What do we want? What do we want now? They came out at noon, not for a lunch break, but to march. Students from Lincoln High School carrying signs made their way downtown. At Terry Shrunk Plaza, they joined other students, including middle schoolers from the private Northwest Academy in Portland. Their mission, to be heard on gun violence, to call out the NRA, gun makers, and lawmakers. Why have you not taken action? Why do you only care that it should be your right to own a gun? Why do you not care that it should be our right to live? That from a 12-year-old and another young voice had this to say. I believe that every place should be a safe place. And we should know, no one deserves to die, especially at a young age, from a gun, some psychopath that wants to just go around and kill children. Our blood, your hands. Fear is a unifying force. And these students, these kids, are unified and angry that gun violence is now the leading cause of death for people their age. Five dead in Texas, 20 dead in Florida, however many children, and I fear that my family could be next. We don't deserve to die and hands of just terrible people. And that is why we act instead of standing back instead of assuming that someone else is going to do it for us, instead of assuming that there is nothing we can do, we must act, because otherwise, nothing gets done. After about a half hour of speeches here at Terry Shrunk Plaza, the students set off to march and spread their message against gun violence throughout downtown Portland. Marching the blocks around the Downtown Justice Center and Federal Courthouse, they kept up the message that gun violence in schools or anywhere else in the U.S. is out of control. Your hands! Our blood! Delivered with urgency as students continued on to Portland City Hall. And gun violence! Where they stopped to rally once more. Stop the silence! In downtown Portland, Tim Gordon, KGW News.